Hello everybody and a good day to you all. Today I'm talking about The Whispers, episode number 10, Darkest Fears. Okay, last episode, they found a way to kill Drill. Now, if you haven't watched the show, Drill is this energy being made out of pure energy which, which adults and children can't see. But only children can hear him. And he talks to children, whispers in their ears, and tells them to do things for his evil purposes. And so, last episode, they found a way they could, they could actually kill Drill because you can't kill energy. You can't destroy it. So, they, so the only way you can kill Drill is to, you have to wait till he possesses a child's body. Once he's inside that child's body, he's vulnerable. He can feel pain and he can die. And so, if you, once, you get, once you get inside the child's body, then you shoot the child in the face, Drill's dead. Well, no one wants to do that. Except for one person. He has issues. I, I guess he has no children because everybody, mostly everybody on the show has a child, and nobody wants to be the one who kills a child to save the world. I mean, nobody wants to shoot a ten-year-old in the face to save ch other children. I mean, even though you're doing a good thing and the results are positive, but who wants that on their conscience? I mean, I shot a child in the face to save the world. How can you celebrate that? You messed up the rest of your life. So nobody wants to do that. So in this episode here, they, they found a better way. They noticed that Drill's energy levels are dropping. He's losing energy. He's losing his strength. Because every time he uses his, his energy to do something, he loses it. So the only way to so he can gain it back, he needs more energy to recharge himself. So let's cut off his food supply. Cut off the power. No power. No energy. Drill goes away. You don't have to shoot a child. Everybody's happy. Everybody's on board. They even got the president on board. So everybody is waiting for them to, sh to for drill to die. So every time, so this is what they do. They locate drill on the energy uh, and energy, follow his energy source. And wherever he pops up, they cut off the, they cut off the power in that city. He goes to another town. They cut off the power. Boom. And then they lead him to a to a house where he's going to sit there and die. That's the plan. Well, here's the problem. It's good to have a plan. Plans are fantastic. A lot of times, plans work. That's why they're there. They get you prepared for a whole lot of different scenarios. But sometimes, even though you may have a plan, the other person may have a better one. You see, Drill doesn't have to go down without a fight, and he'll take down any. And he'll take down anyone else. To make sure his plans come through. And that's pretty much the show. Yeah. Now I enjoyed this episode. It was still fun. A little bit slower than it was a little bit slower than last episode. But it's cause it's still them against drill. And see the thing is though, drill is willing to go in places they're not willing to go. See, drill will kill a child to get what he wants. The thing is though. Will they be able to kill a child to save the world? Oh my God, that's messed up. So, it's like always they do stop Drill, but there is a price to be paid because Drill doesn't like his plans to be stopped. And when his plans get stopped, he has to lay down some punishment. And someone gets punished in this episode, and it's not a good thing. Again, like I said, I do enjoy the episode. It wasn't like fun. It's kind of it was sad and depressing, but enjoyable to watch. It's it's weird to say that sometimes. But it's not because it's weird to say enjoyable to watch because it was it was I did I mean I didn't hate the episode, but it was just painful at the same time. Like oh, why, why? Leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think about this episode. Or did you like it? Did you hate it? Did you love it? Do you have a way that they, they may do you have a plan that you can think of the way they could stop drill? Because I had some options. Like, okay, they could they could do this. Cut off the power again for the whole United States. That would suck. It'll knock us back down to the caveman times, but Drill had nowhere to go. And eventually he will die off. How long will that last? I don't know. Hopefully a couple of days. Hopefully not a week or a couple of months 
or, or a year, because that would really suck. No internet for a whole year? Oh my gosh, that'd be awful. Ugh. But eventually he will die off. Or, cut off his source of communication. So take all the children in the whole United States, put them on a cruise ship, and sail them out in the middle of the ocean. He can't travel any power lines out there. And so, therefore, the children will be safe. No, it, no drill talking to them, whispering in their ears. And eventually, he can't, he can't talk to adults. And he can't take over their bodies. So, eventually, he'll just die on his own. Problem solved. Yay. Or, this is a little crazy. This is way outside the box. This is going out in a whole other... This, this, in fact, it's not even the same game anymore. We switching the whole game to this one. Call the Ghostbusters. I know it's crazy. It's a little weird, but Drew looks mostly like a, most like a, a ghost anyway. He's pretty much a ghost, so call the Ghostbusters. They take him out. Problem solved. Presto, change up. Everybody's happy. They call the Ghostbusters. Who are you going to call? They call them. They fix the day, save the day. Boom. That's a little weird, and it may not happen. So like I said, leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think. So that's all I have to say about that. Give my channel a big old like, hit the thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and share. I really would appreciate it. It's like I always say, in my dreams and in real life, I am the Ninja Rabbit. A peace out of peoples.